Hello, Keiko here, and welcome to the chaos. Let's go. Quest time. I googled the quests, and it looks like there are some quests in Arrow Village and some in the Tanit camp that lead to a bunch of other quests, so we'll probably do those first. Um... Oh, hang on. Um, sorry, I'm, I'm fine, um, <laughs> okay, okay, this isn't gonna end well, okay, basically, hi, it's Child of Peace, I tried my best to sound like Keiko, but I really don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> I genuinely don't know how to play this game. <laughs> That's Keiko. Keiko is laughing in the background. <laughs> um, no, seriously, how do I play this game? <laughs> Can you please tell me how to play this game? <laughs> I did press M. You told me to press M, so I pressed it. <laughs> the camp? Where is the camp? The scroll. <laughs> Where's the desert? Keep going. Down or up? Sideways. Okay. Oh, is that the desert? Down a bit. Down a bit. <laughs> <laughs> what? Look at the thing that looks like, okay, going on the wall. To the right. To the right, what? To the right. Oh, to the right. Up. The thing called Aru Village with a quest. <laughs> oh, the exclamation mark is the quest. <laughs> <laughs> Will you stop cackling in the background, please? <laughs> um, okay, sorry about this, guys. Um, we genuinely were planning to make the- Also, you did not do a very good job of doing me either, because um, you didn't put a capital when you said Keiko. And excuse you, but I put capitals on every beginning of a sentence. Oh my god, okay. Oh, we're doing a roulette- Wait, wait, what do you mean by Keiko roulette? Like, you want Keiko to do a silly voice, or you want me to do a silly voice? I don't know. I, I don't know. I don't know what you're asking. Please explain. She chooses the voice. Oh, Keiko has like four preset voices, and if you, I, I have a variety. And Keiko doesn't know what voices I can do. Do you want to pick a voice? No, I'm gonna make the voice, but you need to pick one. <laughs> she just gave me a look. Okay. Oh no. Hello? Hello? Oh, it's yeah, it's following you again. <laughs> um, okay, I'll ch Oh, am I choosing silly voice? Okay, well I need to find someone to talk to so that- Oh my god, how, what am I doing? Okay, I need to find someone to talk to <laughs> and then I will, um, use that thing. I'll, I'll pick a long one, don't worry. I am um, very used to um, having to get Keiko to pick long ones. Hello there, welcome back to Aro Village. You know me? Ha ha ha, Isaac has mentioned you more than once, so I recognised you right away. 
Honestly, I'm ashamed that I was too much of a mess to thank you, Alia. It's all thanks to you, really, that I'm able to continue living here with him. There was this lady named Sataria who came over to ask me if I wanted to return to the academia, but in the end, I decided to stay here. Oh, this one looks like it's a longer one. Is this long enough for you, Mr. Pyro? Or do you want me to pick a longer one? If you don't answer in the next two... Oh, this is long enough. I'm, I'm going to take that as a yes, this is long enough. Okay. Oh, I need to pick a voice now. I'm going to make it the silliest of silly voices. What are you doing? <laughs> um, <clears throat> for one thing, I can't just leave Isaac to fend for himself here. And on the other hand, our village has helped me a lot. And for the other, leaving just like this doesn't sit right with me. There you go. There's your silly voice. Um, I probably could have picked a better one because I feel like I've done that one before. I may be old, but I was once a researcher too. I should be able to contribute to the villager village's development somehow. Okay, that was Khalil that we just talked to. Hello, Isaac. Let's hear from Isaac. Ah, it's you. Have you been doing okay? Been busy? Are you hungry? Want to come to my place for a bit? Uh, steady there, Mr. Enthusiastic. Maybe next time. All right, you're always welcome here. Oh, he's so sweet. Um, I actually don't know where I'm supposed to be going. Can someone just like tell me left or right? Cause um, press V. Press v. What's V? Hey, just stop doing random words. Were you doing the quest? No, I clicked on random people to get a silly voice thing done. <laughs> oh, okay. Can I talk to this person? I'm gonna talk to all the people. Please stay away, I'm on a mission here. I'm sorry, my dude. Um, hello? See you around. Okay, thanks, my dude. Um, Anyway, ooh, another person. Ah, it's you. We meet again. Same as always. I wish you luck. I. Okay. Yes, thank you for your well wishes. Um. Ooh, ooh, pot, pot. Do we think the pot has a potato in it? Can it have a potato in it? By sheer force of will, it will have a potato in it. Oh, it didn't have a potato in it. Now I'm sad. Ah. Oh my god, I just climbed up on a cactus. No, don't do that, that's spiky. Cats! Um, I think I've reached a dead end area. I don't know. I'm just gonna walk around and hope for the best. And I'm, I'm gonna apologize. Okay, hi, soft hyphen as Wait, no. Wait, what? I thought I was soft hyphen. Is that you? It's yeah, it's you. I I read it as like 128. I don't know why. Brain's not braining today. It's fine. Um, yeah, I don't think Streams La Streamlabs is working. That's what I also assumed because Streamlabs didn't respond that it was because it was someone who wasn't. I I don't know how to fix Streamlabs. Do you have to come up here to fix it? Okay. I'm just going to keep talking to people then. Hmm, we don't have any bandages left. I should probably inform the village head the next time I see him. Oh my god, why can I duel this guy? Oh, okay. <laughs> I thought it was like a sword duel. <laughs> I know there's a card symbol there, but like so. Brain automatically went to sword duel. You're... See you. Okay. See you. May you remain in good health. Thanks. Oh, I'm clicking all the wrong buttons. The prescription can... This prescription can be used for any small ailments. I just want to find potatoes, okay? That's what I'm here for. Um... Ooh! A lift! 
we're not gonna find out today whether I'm better at lifts than Keiko because um, I feel like for all I've been making fun of her, I will somehow manage to mess up and then she will laugh at me. Oh, okay. I don't know what I did. I'm lost. I've just walked around this massive block of- oh, I know where I am. I mean, I know where I am in context to where I was before. Um... Okay, no, I'm- I'm lost. What am I looking for? You said, like, a quest symbol thing? An ex- the blue exclamation- oh, wait, wait, wait. No, that's not helpful. Never mind, ignore me. Where- Uh, M. This one? Yes. Teleport that? Yes. How do I glide? Hmm? Glide. Double space. Okay, cool. I think someone in that tower. Someone in that tower? That's the village, right? Oh, there's someone running. Ooh, I like a good bridge. I would love to walk across a, rag a raggedy bridge? That's not the right word. A uh, rickety bridge, that's the word. Is it this person? Oh, I found this person. I've played Genshin before, but I've pl I've specifically mostly done building work and boss fights, I believe. That's right, isn't it? I've worked on I've worked on Keiko's teapot, um, and then I have done. I've yeah I've I've fought bosses before. That's all I've done. Rose, oh Rose, grant me my wish. Blooming from a stone, the golden rose sang to me. She sang, and he's gone. That's a local fum Fumaru folk. So oh my god, <laughs> Sumeru folk song called "The Singing Rose." Right? It's such a cute song. Too bad the boy ran off halfway through. Paimon would have loved to hear the whole thing and say hi to him. You must be new here. First time in Arrow Village. Well, I'm pretty sure it's a no because I, I remember you trying to pronounce this. Um, I'm gonna go with no. Huh. Did I guess wrong? Let me think again. Well then, are you scholars looking to study abroad in Sumeru? I know that there are many foreign scholars in the academia. We do know a lot of scholars, but we aren't quite like them ourselves. Technically, we're adventurers. The glorious, world trotting duo Paimon and Keiko127. World trotting haha. <laughs> I'm not very good at the laughs. I can't help but read ha 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 as very dryly. Um, what's so funny? We're super famous adventurers, believe it or not. No, I wasn't mocking you, friends from far away. It's just the opposite. It's a delight to hear uplifting stories like people traveling the world. When you're as detached from the world as I am, such enthusiastic remarks can really catch you off guard. I'm sorry if I offended you. My name's Saba. I offer you my apologies, as well as my welcome to the village. Ah yes, were you talking about the Rose Folk song that Zayad was singing? Zayad? Zayad? Uh, look, I look things up for Keiko, I don't just know how to pronounce things. Um, correct? We can talk more about it if you're interested, I hope it will liven up your journey. Are you going to sing for us, Saba? Paimon's dying to hear the rest of it. Sorry, I'm not good at singing, but we can discuss what the song is about. Sure, so that kid sang about the rose granting wishes. Yes, in a tiny village like ours, we don't have a big Athenaeum like they do at the Academia. Our, all our songs are passed down orally. It's my belief that the wish granting flower in the song represents the collective imagination of our ancestors. In a harsh environment like the desert, water is an extremely vital resource, so they prized water-storing plants. 
So the more adverse the terrain, the more stories that there are about plants. It's a reflection of our ancestors yearning for a better life. At the same time, plants are also a part of the symbiotic relationship between our ancestors and the flora and fauna of the desert. However, our is built on sand and the soil here is actually not suitable for the cultivation of Sumeru roses. The Sumeru roses I planted could never grow. So if you ask me, the golden rose in the song must have been a product of pe people's imagination. Uh, hold on, Paimon can't keep up anymore. Is this what you usually talk with people about, Miss Saba? Ah, I'm sorry, I thought since you were new here, you'd prefer such topics over farming or the weather. Paimon got lost somewhere between symbiotic relationship and the collective imagination, but don't worry, Paimon understood that last sentence. <laughs> Thanks, Paimon. Um... You said that the land here isn't suitable for Sumeru roses, right? We've also only seen them in places with moist soil. Well, this place is mostly sand after all. Roses sure are picky customers. Speaking of roses, I was thinking that since you two are adventurers, perhaps I can hire you to... Now we're talking, we're battle-hardened adventurers. We can do any job, no problem. So what can we help you with? I know it's ridiculous to want roses that don't belong here to bloom. But regardless, I still want to see them. I'm embarrassed to even say it, but that is my wish. Based on what I know about roses, they will grow if fertilised with highly concentrated dendro, even if you grow them in the sand. But it's near impossible to get such fertiliser out here, so I'm wondering if you may be able to get your hands on some. Dendro? Yes, dendro promotes plant growth and works especially well on poor crops. But I'm just a normal person without a dendro vision and I lack the resources to obtain effective fertilizer. I'm sorry, that just made me think of the opening for Miraculous. Um, that's all. That's why I laughed. Hmm, if it's just dendro you want, this is pretty easy. We got this. Miss Saba really loves roses, huh? She hired us even though she knew that roses aren't suited to this place at all. Paimon understands that feeling. It's like when you're already full, but still feel the urge to eat when you see street food. Uh-huh. You know what? There's act they're actually the same obsession, just for different things. That's why we gotta help her. I mean, at least Paimon has the right idea, even though it's, you know, food-centered. Um, which, you know, we, we, we should have been expecting it's Paimon. Um, use the power of dendro to fertilize the seeds. Uh, I don't know how this works. Okay, I clicked a button. Can you wield dendro? Are you someone with a vision? I haven't met anyone like that in a long time. What a nostalgic feeling. It should be fine now, right Miss Saba? That's right, they should sprout soon if powered by dendro. Let's just wait for a while. Gradually, sprouts begin peeking out of the soil. They stop growing after spr sprouting a few leaves. They're sprouting! Paimon knew you could do just about anything, Keiko127. The results were immediate, as I thought. Thank you. Too bad there are no flowers yet. Oh, that's normal. You can't rush such things. Plants have to go through stages of growth. That you are able to make them sprout is already quite amazing. Give the roses some more time to take in the nourishment. It will be better for them as well. I'm very grateful to you as it is. I wouldn't wish to bother you further. Just drop by and see them in your spare time. That would be enough. Okay, is that the quest? Com that's the quest completed. Now what do I do? Do I pick another quest? Wait, no, there's another exc exclamation mark here. <laughs> I see you've uh, joined in uh, Mr. Pyro with the, um, with the Streamlabs echoing. Oh wait, Streamlabs is back. Wow, I was not paying enough attention. I mean, I, I registered that Streamlabs was there, but like, I didn't process it. Do you understand now? Wait, do you now understand where you went wrong? Yes, I know. 
And where was that exactly? I... I shouldn't have trusted in rumours. And? And, uh, I... I shouldn't have gone babbling to your grandson about that hearsay? Well, that was wrong of you, yes, but is that really the most important thing? What's the point of just knowing things? Do them! That's the important part. It's because you're always lounging around at home that you wound up believing these those baseless rumours. You're still young, you've got still got all the time in the world to learn new things. Why don't you follow Sataria's example and go study? Yes, yes, you're right. Oh, well that's a fun conversation. Um, why is there still an exclamation mark for a quest? I, don't, I feel like I didn't actually do the quest that was here. Hmm? There's two quests here. Okay. I'm gonna climb and see if I can find the second quest. Ah, I fell. You can, oh, are you gonna use your seeds? <laughs> Oh, hello. Ah. I'm doing great. I believe in me. Um. Earthquakes and sandstorms. Hello, what can I help you with? Oh, okay, this is nothing as well. See you around. Goodbye, please be careful and do watch your step. Thanks. Um, okay, I am confused. Unless it's like all the way up- oh wait, it could be all the way up there. Should I climb? I'm gonna climb. I don't know what I'm doing. I should point out I'm very bad at most video games except for Sims, which is why Keiko lets me access the teapot because um, it's essentially like Sims. Oh, hello. Press V, you'll get a ping that will guide you. V. Hello. It didn't do anything. Am I clicking the right button? Yeah, I'm clicking V. It's not doing anything that I can see. Am I missing something? Um... Yeah, Streamlabs is um, having a day, it seems. Hello! Hi, dra the drawing founder. Welcome. Hi, how are you? No, I've got stuck. I got stuck. Ah. Building teapot is fun until I realise I have to go get some materials. Oh, I don't go get materials. I let Keiko do that. And then I... Yeah, I I just build with whatever ever she already has. I don't know how to get up there. This was a mistake. Mistakes were made today. Um Yeah, I can't see how to get up there. Is there a way to get up there? There must be. Oh, Oh wait, I can see the exclamation mark! I can see the blue exclamation mark! Guys, I did it! I f oh, I fell. I found it! Um, oh god, do I have to balance on this? I fell. <laughs> I didn't think I was gonna be able to balance on that. Hello! Hi! Yeah, it's- it's- it's Child of Peace here. Um, yeah, I- um, I crawled out of the walls and I've now invaded Keiko's house. She's really thrilled about it. Um, <laughs> is it fun being on the other side of um, all of the redeems? Like the Keiko down? <laughs> yes, we appreciate Yao Yao in this house. Ugh, there is just no time at all. And no one will swap shifts with me either. What do I do now? Eh? Traveller? Um, Traveller, please hold on a moment. What's going on? 
I'm sorry for taking up your time, but I'd like to ask if you're free and if you could do me a favour. Well, let's hear your story then. If you've got the pay, I've got the time. You'd help me? Thank you. Thank you so much. Here's the situation. I ordered a flower pot from Az Azalai's shop alongside a batch of seeds. Originally, I had asked a friend to help me get them. <laughs> Can you spam distracted the entire stream because Keiko is technically not there? Keiko is technically there and she is technically doing stream related stuff. She is catching up on chickens. So technically she's not distracted. If she gets distracted from chickens, then yes, go ahead and spam the distracted. But as long as she's drawing chickens, she's technically not distracted. And we're going to take that as a win. Um, but he suddenly told me that he had a mission to attend to and wouldn't have time to help me out. There was too little time for me to find someone else. So Traveller, could you please help me collect my my purchases from Azalai's? I hear that he should be at the entrance to the village right now, waiting for the goods to come in. What did you buy all this stuff for anyway? Okay, I will keep an eye out for if Keiko gets distracted. I might just randomly throw in that she's distracted when she's not, just for fun, because that's fun for me. Um, therefore my girlfriend, Nermin. She's in poor health, so she's been convalescing at home. I mean, you've seen it too. Our village is in the middle of the desert, so then there's not much greenery to go around. Can't say this is the best environment, can you? So I bought some plants to place in her house, but always staying in her room has kept her in a bad mood. I'm also very busy at work, so I basically can't go see her go to see her in the day. We only have time to talk to each other at night. That's why I thought that perhaps I could get her to raise some flowers herself, if only just to help pass the time and I could take her mind off her illness. You're currently t typing in chat, Keiko. <laughs> like, they can see you. Um, if only just to help pass the time and take her mind off her illness. I didn't expect things to get complicated like this. I'll go on your behalf, I'll get your things. Thank you so much, just bring them straight back to me once you get them. I need to sow those seeds, loosen the soil, apply some fertilizer. But Nerman's constitution isn't that great. Will all this work just tire her out? Ask Keiko, she has several plants. Is it tiring looking after plants? You can respond in chat. Um. Yeah. Okay. Um, where's the entrance? Village entrance must be this way? Ah! Oh, I got stuck. <laughs> That was a terrible descent. Yeah, that's true. If all the plants are cacti, then it's a lot easier to take care of. Like my cactus Bob, who is still miraculously alive, even though my mum has dropped him on several occasions. Atia, join the... Join the Ar Ar Aramites and embrace a wonderful new life. Come, friend, would you like to hear about the Ar Aramites? Uh... Oh, come on, just listen up a bit. The Aramites is a good community to be a part of. We're free, we're united, friendly too. And if you join... This very much gives me the, the vibes of, join us, we have cookies. Um, and if you join up with us, you'll get a chance to fleece those tree dwellers of their fat wallets. The Academia's researchers are a rich lot, and they are not ones to default on their payments either. I'm already in the Adventurer's Guild. I've already got a ton of commissions on my plate. Eh? You're with the Adventurer's Guild? I mean, that's no obstacle, is it? Come on, everyone's got a side hustle nowadays. It's not like adventurers and mercenaries are really all that different. You get what I mean? I think they're pretty different. Well, we've got food here too. Meat and fish are regulars on the menu. Is this guy getting paid to recruit? Is he a recruiter? He, he very much feels like those um, scam calls that you get where they're just trying to keep you talking even though you're like, um, no thank you. 
And if you're lucky, you might even get to meet Dea, the flame main. Now I... <laughs> Calm down, get some water. You've had some practice with this pitch, huh? Sorry, sorry, I spoke too quickly there. I haven't had anyone listen to my pitch for a while now, so I got a little excited there. Yep, definitely getting the vibes of a spam caller. Still, are you really not even going to consider joining us? Not at the moment. I really do have my hands full with Adventurer's Guild business. Alright, if you say so. Are you always recruiting people here? Yes, I mean it is my job after all. Nowadays, able hands are in short supply everywhere, and nowhere is that shortage more acute than in the mercenary hist in mer mercenary industry. Sigh. Well, I guess I can't. Uh, well, I guess I can just tell you. We've got people, that's for sure. But our line of work is very dangerous. Things like escorting people are on the easier side, but it's just tiring at most. But if, you work, if your work involves researchers, then it's like putting your head on the block. You'll be blessed to come back in one piece. After coming back from these missions, most of our members have to take at least 10 days to half a month off. So we always need people to fill in those gaps. Sumeru is a big place with lots of researchers, so we've got new work coming in every day. We're basically working around the clock at this point. So yeah, we need to get some new people or we're going to buckle under the load. In that case, have you managed to find anyone who's on board? You mean here in this village? Haha, <laughs> nope, not a one. Actually, I should correct myself. It's more that people I'd love to have join don't want to, and that I wouldn't take those who want to join. You can't be picky when you need more people. If you don't believe me, why don't we take a quick walk about together? Who knows? You might have just you might just be convinced by the time we're done. Kidding, kidding. I know you said you didn't want to join. I w have I started another quest that is separate from the one that I was doing? Because I feel like I've done that. And I won't force you. I, I just like, I just, you know, like some company while I have a little walk. I can go with you, no problem. Hee <laughs> hee, thanks a lot. Let me see. Let's go look for Sanya first. She's usually free in the day, but at night, well, she's usually busy having important discussions with Jabari. Um. Oh, yes. Yeah, it's pirate chicken next. I'm excited. I'm still obsessed with pirates. It's an ongoing obsession. Where am I supposed to be going? Like, that guy just disappeared, and I'm supposed to be looking for the guy who's at the entrance of the village? But I don't know where the guy who's at the entrance of the village is. Press J. Press J? Yeah. What quest do you want to do in the list? Uh... Ah. Uh. Why won't it scroll? Okay. Which one? I don't even know which ones I was doing. Okay. Um. Whoops. No, those ones are sitting like ages away. Fontaine, Fontaine. Um, I can't see it anywhere. Scroll down. Oh, this one. Capture the butterflies. Um. Next one down, Blooming Sand. Oh yeah, that's that's the one. Oh, thank you. Oh look, there's a little helpy thing. I can see the dude we're going for now. Hello! Huh, so there was another batch after all. Hey, about Rafe's- Rafe's goods? Oh, you mean the stuff you ordered from me? Well, you're in luck. The batch of goods I just received has his stuff in there. 
I must say, though, that he ordered quite a lot of things. Are you here to pick up his order? Are they very heavy? How much did he order? Well, apart from that pot, he's also ordered various seeds, fertilizer, and other items used in gardening. They're pretty weighty when put together. Are you sure you'll be fine by yourself? I've got my ways. I did agree to help, so... Ah, is that so? Well, that's fine. I'll just get all this stuff wrapped up for you. Thanks for making the trip, by the way. Okay, so I have, I, that means I've got the package, right? So I just go back. Bring the stuff back to Rafe, yes. He was up in one of the towers. Oh, that tower. Yeah. Easy enough to get to. Um... <gasps> Kitty cat! Hello. I'm not going to move you, don't worry. Oh, I'm really looking forward to Laura Accurate Keiko. That's going to be an exciting one. Traveller, have you brought the stuff? These are the ones. Thank you so much, Traveller. Sure you're not trying to open your own flower shop? What do you need so much stuff for? Uh, well, I, I just wanted to buy more at once to save myself some extra trips, you know? Anyway, go rest over there for a while. I need to sow these seeds and put some fertilizer in and... Rafe starts working on the flower pot. Alright, this should do it. All Norman needs to do is just water this plant. Traveller, could I, uh, trouble you to help me bring this flower pot to her? Why don't you go yourself? I need to guard this path. If any foodstuffs or goods pass through, I'll, I'll need to make- I'll need to get more people from the village to come take them. And you know how it is around here. If we're too slow, the goods are going to spoil under the sun. Just do me this favour, please. Norman's not far from here. All you have to do is give this pot of flowers to her. I'll find a way to bring the rest to her. All right, all right, let's find Norman and... Um, I don't know which direction to go in. Um, it was J. Oh, it's, no, it's still got navigation on, okay. Um, I can't see... It says 30 meters, but like, in which direction? Huh? Press B. Oh, yes. Oh, hello. Oh, read their minds. Did you want me to go back up and read his mind? Okay. I'll do it. I can hear about 20% of what you're saying. Because I've got this music in my ears. Hello again. E. I hope Norman will cheer up. Me too, Rafe. Rafe, me too. Ah. Oh, hello. Hello. Why did this trail stop? Cyrus the Sumpter Beast! I remember Cyrus the Sumpter Beast. Oh, it shakes its head from side to side. That's so cute. Um. Oh, wait, okay, okay. Oh, no, that's higher, lower. No, it's not lo- is it? Oh wait, 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 okay, okay, okay. 15 meters. Quest area reached and I fell. Um, I'm in the water now. You are really enjoying that Keiko down button, aren't you? K 
Keiko is taking advantage of the fact that for once it's not her falling down, it's me. Um, I've now got to go 50 meters to get back <laughs> to get back to Nerman. Man, I do this in real life too. I'd just walk off the edge of a cliff thinking that I was going in the right direction. Can you use E on um on the Sumter Beasts? Was that what you were trying to tell me to do? The real one who's suffering is you. Why are you suffering, Kira? Also, yes, all those arms and limbs can't wait. You're not being. Uh, sorry, do you want me to say. <laughs> do you want me to say those? I can say them. It's fine, it's okay. It's all gonna be just fine. Okay, um. Hello, are we almost there? Because I feel like Nahida is running out of um, stamina. Come on, come on. Ah, no! What happened? What happened? Oh, okay, yeah, Nahida's going down. <laughs> ah. Yeah, Nahida died. <laughs> Okay, it's it's Yao Yao time. Um, this was never my intention. Okay, I thought I was safely on that platform, but um, turns out I was not. Um, I forgot I could also like jump climb. So um, this will make it quicker. Uh, if I can figure out where I'm supposed to be going. <sighs> dearing me, dearing me. We'll get there eventually, in three to five business days. And we might lose Yao Yao in the process? Um, oh my god. Okay, we are gonna lose Yao Yao in the process. No, Yao Yao. Yao Yao, no. <laughs> oh, the golden icons. Okay. Okay, Yao Yao's. <laughs> Yao Yao's dead. <laughs> um, okay, gold, there's a golden icon, icon down there. Where's that gonna take me? How do I use them? What do I click? <laughs> hmm? T. T. Yeah. Oh, hello. What did I do? No. I think I accidentally used E. It's not working. Just use the map and teleport somewhere else. Oh. We're going to the start of the seventh, so you can heal me out now in the heater. Okay. <laughs> um, Keiko is not happy with me. Um, I, w I wonder why. It's, it's not like I killed um, her favourite character and another one of her favourite characters. Um, I don't know what I just did. I just clicked a button. Should I just leave? I'm gonna leave. I, I don't want to click things and I have a really bad habit of clicking things. If there is a big red button that you're you're told you're not supposed to click, I will click it and it will be a mistake and I will regret it but I'll do it because it's a big red button that tells me not to click it so I will click it. Oh my god, is she down there? Oh, she's down there. Oh my god, why do I keep clicking E? Don't mean to keep clicking E. Someone inside hears movement. It's, uh, it's basically a comically large red button with arrows pointing towards it saying do not click. I would still click it, okay? It's a big red button, it's begging to be clicked. 
Right, hello, may I help you with anything? Well, I'm here to give you this flower pot. Huh, is this from Wraith? There are flowers in this pot. Really? Thank you for helping him send this to me. I like it very much. But can I really raise these flowers properly? They're flowers, not children. You'll be fine. You can't mess them up too badly in a way that would permanently damage them, you know? I mean... Is it your first time growing flowers? Well, no, I'm just not very good at taking care of plants. The previous ones all withered in my hands. I imagine this pot of flowers must be even more delicate still. If I were to fail to care for it properly again... Oh no, I just... I can't just... Since the flowers are already in my hands, I must take good care of it. Perhaps Granny Coulson... 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 Coulson? Knows how to solve this problem. Why am I standing on the pot? That is... That's so rude of me. I'm so sorry, Norman. I'm... Oh, horrific. I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to um, desecrate your plants. I mean, do not click is basically click, but with a not. Just don't read the not. Correct. This sign can't stop me because I can't read. Um... Just let me fly. Oh, I forgot to click forward. Oh, I want to collect the flowers. Flowers. Henna berry. Yes, please. Give me all the henna berries. I'm taking all the henna berries. Sorry, Keiko, you're going to have like 50 henna berries. Hmm? Use Nahida. I forgot I had Nahida back. Ah. Oh, you. <laughs> okay, Keiko apparently already has 50 Hannah Berries. Well, you're gonna have 50 more by the end of this. Congrats. Why can't I do anything? I'm so bad at climbing. <laughs> I'm stuck. <laughs> this is where I wanted to be, actually. Thank you very much, guys. Henneberry! I'm just gonna keep climbing, because why not? Pornahita, yeah, Pornahita having to be controlled by me. I'm a mess. It's going great. Um, where was I supposed to be going? I do. Oh, oh, Madam Coulson, Coulson, and I think she was the old lady who was berating that young man. So I think I vaguely remember where she was. Oh, how are Saba's plants getting along? They look all right. Yeah, there she is. Okay, I've already had this interaction. Oh, I thought it was- I thought it was gonna be a different interaction, because I swear we were just told to go talk to her. Were we not told to just go talk to her? Um. Go away- hang on. I was trying to push him away so that I could talk to- I should have given that brat a good scolding ages ago. Okay. Please stop scolding me. A mood. Um. Right, report back- oh, report back to Wraith. Okay, that's what I'm supposed to be doing. Okay, I can do that. Oh dear, did the end fall out of your word there, Kira? Traveller, thank you so much for helping out. This is such a weird angle. How is Nerman doing? She's worried that she won't be able to take care of flowers. Have you never sent her flowers before? Well, I wouldn't say that exactly, but the ones I would ask people to help me buy for her were already fully grown. By the time they arrived in the village, they were nearly all dried out. That's why I decided that I would send her a freshly planted pot of flowers this time. 
Well, in any case, thank you for helping me out, Traveller. Please, take this as your reward. I'll send the other items to her later. Wait a moment, did these gardening, gardening tools not come with instruction manuals? Oh no, I have no idea how to use them! Yeah, most of them are pretty self-explanatory, to be honest. Um... Yay! So wait, does that mean I've completed the quest? But now I've got to go walk around the village with that guy. Where's that guy gone? The salesman, the recruiter dude. Okay, I've got to go find the recruiter and walk- oh, ah! Sorry. I forgot that I had that alarm on. <laughs> um, yeah, no, that's- it's fine. Um... Oh yeah, I should warn you, I have an alarm that goes off at 9.45 from when I used to leave streams at 10. Don't ask me why I didn't take it off my phone. I don't know why I didn't. I just ignore it now whenever Keiko streams. Um, where is the dude who I'm supposed to be following? I swear he said that he wanted to go on a walk around the village and then he disappeared and now I don't know where he's gone. Um... Okay, I'm I'm sure I'm sure he's around here somewhere. You know what? I'm just going to click buttons that I now know exist. Uh I mean, I guess we want to find one that's very close to us. Oh, join the Eremites and embrace a wonderful Okay, that sounds like a pyramid scheme. Guys, is this a pyramid scheme? Am I joining a pyramid scheme? Guys, this is so exciting. Let's go join a pyramid scheme. Oh, well, there he is. Oh, wait, no. That's someone else. That's Sanya. Oh! Wait, what? Okay. How worrying. Good afternoon, Sanya. What are you buying? <gasps> oh, that's a good joke, Mr. Pyro. That's a good joke. I respect that. I respect that so hard. Okay, I've told you many times before, Atia. Jabari isn't interested in joining you. Nor do I want him to go become a mercenary. I'm not going to help you convince him. Well, that's a shame. With his cul culinary skills, Jabari would do really well with us. And your family's financial standing would be improved greatly too. This is definitely a pyramid scheme. And hasn't he said before that he'd like to go out and find work? If that's what he really wants, who better to recommend work than an old friend, eh? <laughs> Don't take anything he says seriously. He'll tell you that one day that he'll tell you that one day and change his mind the next. In the end, he just can't bear to leave me here alone in the village, and I can bear to see him slogging away all by himself either. What's more, you're asking that he risk his neck out there as a mercenary. Even if he wanted to go, I'd stop him for sure. Let's just leave this topic be. I've got things to buy. Go bother someone else. Hang on, let's see. Oh yeah, the Keiko model would have... Yeah, it, it doesn't do too well with two people in the room. Um, I would fall down a chair, but you would also hear if I fell off, off of the chair because that... that it is something that I would do. Um, phew. Alright then. You see, Traveller, this is what work looks like for me every day. Next up on my list of people to meet is... Fodil? Fodil? Oh, hello. Oh. He was one of us once, but he quit. Sure would be nice if I could convince him to make a bit of a comeback. Uh, alright, let's find a guy whose name I can't pronounce. Fodil? Fodil? Someone, someone correct me who knows what they're talking about. Because I can't read- I usually am the one who's looking at, at YouTube videos and finding out what their- how, how people's names are pronounced and then sending it to Keiko, but, like, I can't do that when I'm streaming.
Hmm? Ooh, exciting. Where are we going? 102 meters. Okay, that is lower than- oh my god, were you- why are you climbing? I didn't want you to keep climbing. Okay. Um, oh my god, these headphones are falling off my head. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's just, it was a tactical retreat to Earth, correct. Oh my god, stop climbing! Okay, okay. Right, 96 meters, 94 meters, 93, 91. Okay, we're going in the right direction now, at least. Oh, no, 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 that's not the right direction. This is the right direction. Oh, lower. 73 meters lower. Uh, 68, 67. Oh, we still want to go lower. Okay. This could go really well or really badly. Six. Oh, what? Oh, okay, I've got to go higher. This is like playing that card game, higher or lower. <laughs> um, uh, lower 71 meters, 64. Okay, okay, we're, we're lowering the numbers again. 54, 50, 47, um, 39, 30, oh, wait, okay. Oh, oh, wait, 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 maybe, maybe, Fodl, Fodl, no one actually corrected me on the pronunciation of the name, um, is over here by, oh, it's this guy. Tia, not you again. Hehe, <laughs> persistence is one of our virtues, you know. Well, then you should know that sticking to principles is mine. Come on now, brother. I've left the organization already, don't call me that. Right, right. Um, all right, Fodor. You're sh you sure you're not considering coming back at all? I know that some of us can be a bit reckless, but most of us are perfectly law-abiding citizens. Okay, sure, citizens. I've said this before, Tia. I'm not going back. The things you speak of, I've already confirmed them with my own two eyes. Perhaps not all the Eremites are a lawless lot, but not every Eremite enjoys kicking those who have already gone down. But ill deeds spread it here. All it takes is one person to act like the law is merely a suggestion and everyone else will be affected by them. One person influences another, and if that group keeps acting a certain way, they will influence yet more people. I'm sure you know what that means better than I do it here. It is all too easy to do evil in such an environment. That very much still sounds like a pyramid scheme. One person does evil and then everyone else starts doing evil and everyone else starts doing evil. It's a pyramid scheme, I'm telling you. You wish for me to return, just as I wish for you to leave. Perhaps from your perspective, the Eremites are not an evil organization, even if they're not exactly honorable. But you can't always live in shades of grey. This is just a word of advice. You may do with it as you will. I know, Chief. Alright, if you do leave and need a new line of work, I will help you. Are you alright? Heh, <laughs> well, there's no way I can win an argument with the Fodal, I guess. Fodal, Fodal, someone correct me, please. What's next? Right, right, let's rest a bit. I gotta say, my throat's getting tired after all that. Man, I'm reading out your lines and everyone else's lines. My throat's getting tired. Um, join, oh, hang on. Go back and take a break. Oh, well, that's fun. Thanks for watching, everyone. If you've enjoyed the video, make sure to like and subscribe. If you'd like to see me play live, then check out my Twitch channel. You can find me on Wednesdays and Sundays at 8pm GMT. Thanks again and have a great day.